My character, Victoria, has been tormented by her very sworn enemy, Dorian, played by my very dear friend, Robin Strasser. And frankly, we've had more knockdown, drag out battles than I can count. <laughs> Take a look. We are already in hell. And you know the only way we're going to get out of here. Yes, I believe. I believe I do. Give me the key. No. Give me the key. No, I'm not kidding. Give me the, the key, Dorian. Give me that damn key. No, I'm not kidding. And I will fight you for it, Dorian. Oh. Please, please welcome Robin Strasser. Bravo, bravo, Robin. Yes, I brought Dorian with me. I couldn't count on the fact that I, I'd be able to hold it together. The adrenaline is going like this. Can you see? It's like boom, the boom, the boom. Now you have your security stole. Oh, I wanted everyone to know that I came with a purpose. And if this, if this is the last time I get to dress up as Dorian, I'm making it count. Yeah. the fights between the two of you on set. I mean, literally, I'm not alone in saying we could watch those clips all day, right? We could just go back in time. What is it about the two of you and your angst that, that had everybody so in love? Because we love the fights. Um, there was love there. I'm going to so answer. The, the whole relationship between Vicky and Dorian started out of a misunderstanding, where Dorian thought that Vicky had voted to get her off the hospital board, and Vicky was the only one who voted to keep her on. So she went after my father. For his money, which Vicky realized right away, and it, it snowballed from there. But it's been the strongest relationship on the show forever. Also, didn't you sleep with her son, who was much younger? That's oh. another. Yes. Yes. Yeah, but it was Nathan Philly. Yes, it, it was Nathan Philly, and I rest my case. <laughs> and I would do it again for free. Yes. <laughs> You, 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 okay, Dorian and Vicky got into so many, as we have seen, so many screaming matches and fighting. Mm, yes. What was it like, Robin, to film those scenes? Did you get hurt ever? You, <laughs> you know what it was like? It was like going into the ring with a black belt champion. Because oh, wow. when you knew you were working with Miss Slazak, you brought your best. I would just do everything to be ready to walk on the set and give it my all because I, I had the opportunity and oh, oh, oops, the blessing to work with the best of the best. Well, let me return the favor because I have always said that as an actor you have to bring something to the table. Every single scene that Robin Strasser was ever in, she not only brought something, she brought a Thanksgiving Day feast to the table. <laughs> were so touching and so sweet and I missed you terribly and after so, that. Robin, I'm, it's so funny because watching, I've been watching you since I was four years old and I even was a little scared when I, when I talked to Robin backstage because you, you, so you would play this mean, nasty little witch and, and it's just like, and, and now to see you tearing up, oh my goodness, but what will you miss the most? Erica about? Slezak and the clothes. <laughs> The Call me shallow. <laughs> I don't care. No. I deserve it. No. You would have there. And maybe the men, because Vicky and Dorian have fought over everything, including those fellows. So let's bring out the man you fought over most recently, none other oh. than Clint Buchanan. Please welcome.
That's a nice reunion. And that's a proper placement there because I have to ask you. Yes. Took over the role six years ago and then but between these two women, <laughs> you are betwixt in love. Between six years the two ago, um, uh, the Lord put me in Landview. <laughs> And lo and behold, between these two lovely ladies, <laughs> and who does God love? Obviously me, because I have been blessed for the past six years. Before Jerry came on, uh, you know, I asked around, and everybody had wonderful things to say about working with him. Oh, they were all true. Oh, he's, he's... I got emails from total strangers. You're so lucky you get to work with Jerry the dog. Everybody loves Jerry. Oh. And they do. And with reason. With yeah. reason. Were you and he's also the Tic Tac carrier. Yes, you I just saw those You know, Robin skin. was in a lot of body suits and showing off her body. Did you ever feel uncomfortable with that, or did you enjoy it? In those days, when yeah. I had a body, I... <laughs> Heck yes. You liked it? What was it? Big shoes to fill when you took the role. Were you nervous? Yes, I was nervous. I was very nervous. First of all, it's like being dropped into the middle of a Russian novel. Mm -hmm. and, and I was on page 325 and somebody cued me and said, go. <laughs> and thanks to this lady, who has an encyclopedic memory, mm -hmm. she could fill me in on all who I slept with, who's my children. <laughs> all. She brought me up to speed on so many things. Oh. But uh, I knew Clint Ritchie and I tried not to emulate him or mm -hmm. act like him. But instead, I chose to act it like Phil Carey. Yeah. <laughs> In the uh, sense that sons become their fathers uh, and uh, yes. daughters become their mothers. What a lovely yeah. way to think of it. We're yeah. so glad the three of you are here with yeah. us right now. We want to give our thanks to Robin Strasser and Jerry for Dorn. We are going to be right back with Robert S. Woods and Hillary B. I'm, I'm very proud of and very happy we've been able to do.